Mummy Pig and Daddy Pig have been tidying the house. <laughs> Mummy Pig and I found this old box in the attic. <sighs> Ooh. Can anyone guess what's inside? Hmm. Nope. <laughs> it's full of musical instruments. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> they are a bit old and dusty. <sighs> ah, chew. <laughs> <laughs> This is the violin I used to play when I was little. Mummy, can you play your violin? I haven't played it for a long time. Please, Mummy, please play it. <coughs> I hope I haven't forgotten how. Bravo! <laughs> <laughs> Mummy, can I play the violin? Hold it like this. Yes, Mummy! Ooh. Oh dear, I do not think it is meant to sound like that. <coughs> George wants to try. Hold it like this, George. <coughs> oh, that does not sound quite right either. The violin is too hard to play. Pepper, <coughs> maybe you would do better with this tin drum. <coughs> Thank you, Daddy. That sounds better. Pepper loves playing the drum. Oh, lovely! Yes, it sounds very nice. This is Daddy Pig's old accordion. I used to play this to Mummy Pig when we first met. Oh, Daddy Pig. I remember this tune. <laughs> <laughs> George wants to play the accordion, too. Are you sure, George? The accordion is quite difficult. George, the accordion is almost as difficult to play as my drum. <laughs> OK, George. <laughs> oh. Maybe George is a bit too little to play the accordion. Daddy, what other instruments are in the box? Just this horn. Can I try? You have to blow it very hard. <gasps> that does not sound right. It's impossible. I think I used to be able to play it. <gasps> that really does not sound right. <laughs> Maybe it just needs someone big and strong like me. <sighs> That does not sound right either. <sighs> Peppa's right. It is impossible to play. Never mind, Daddy Pig. Just stick to the accordion. <coughs> you play it beautifully. <laughs> well, I do play it quite nicely, even if I say so myself. And I'll play my violin. And I will play my drum. Mummy Pig plays the violin. Daddy Pig plays the accordion. Pepper plays the drum. But what instrument will George play? <laughs> George is blowing the horn. Mummy couldn't play the horn, and Daddy couldn't play it, and even I couldn't play it. <laughs> but George can play it. <laughs> George are drinking orange juice. <laughs> what noisy little piggies. <laughs> George, look at all the tiny bubbles. 
<laughs> I can make bigger bubbles. <gasps> Peppa is blowing bubbles in her drink. <laughs> Bubble! George wants to blow bubbles too. <gasps> George, you really shouldn't play with your food. Sorry, Daddy. <laughs> Pepper, if you like bubbles, why don't you play with your bubble mixture? Yes, my bubble mixture. <laughs> George, let's blow bubbles in the garden. <laughs> <laughs> Pepper is showing George how to blow bubbles. First, dip the stick in the mixture. Then, take a big breath and blow. <gasps> Bubble! <laughs> George, now it's your turn. Dip the stick in the mixture. Hold it up. Take a big breath. And blow! George is trying really hard, but he is running out of breath. Achoo! <laughs> George, you didn't blow hard enough. I know a way George can make bubbles. Dip the stick in the mixture, then lift it up and wave it around. <laughs> Bubble! <laughs> it's even better if you run along. <laughs> Wait for me! <laughs> George is having fun making bubbles. And Pepper is having fun popping them. I love bubbles! <laughs> oh dear, the bubble mixture is all used up. <laughs> Daddy! <laughs> Mommy! There's no more bubble mixture. Don't worry, Pepper. I have an idea. Mummy Pig, bring me a bucket, please. Yes, Daddy Pig. Peppa, bring me some soap. Yes, Daddy Pig. George, bring me my old tennis racket. <laughs> a bucket, some soap, a tennis racket. What is Daddy Pig doing? First, I need some water. <laughs> then the soap. <laughs> And now, the tennis racket, please. <laughs> Thank you. Now watch this. <gasps> Ooh, wow! <laughs> Daddy Pig has made his own bubble mixture. Come on, everyone! <laughs> be careful, Daddy Pig. Don't slip and fall. I'll be fine. Whoa. <laughs> Are you okay, Daddy Pig? Yes, I'm fine. <laughs> Two. Wow! Daddy Pig has made the biggest bubble ever. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, I've spilt all my bubble mixture. Now we can't make any more bubbles. <sighs> but we can play jumping in muddy puddles. Look! Daddy Pig's bubble mixture has made a big muddy puddle. Hooray! Peppa loves jumping up and down in muddy puddles. Look! The bubble mixture has made the puddle all bubbly. <laughs> Peppa loves jumping up and down in muddy, bubbly puddles. Everyone loves jumping up and down in muddy, bubbly puddles. Holly's holiday. Granny and Grandpa Pig are going on holiday. They are bringing Polly Parrot to Peppa's house so Peppa and George can look after her. Ah! <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hello, Grandpa Pig. Hello, Granny Pig. <laughs> Polly is very excited about her holiday with Peppa and George. <laughs> Hello, Polly. Ah! Hello, Polly. <laughs> Polly Parrot copies everything that is said. What's in Polly's suitcase, Granny? This is Polly's food. George, can you guess what Polly likes to eat best? Chocolate cake! <laughs> no, not chocolate cake. Polly likes bird seed. Ah, bird seed! <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Can I feed her, Granny Pig? Can I feed her? Yes. It's very important not to give Polly too much food. Yes, Grandpa Pig. <laughs> Grandpa, can Polly come out of the cage? Yes, but you must keep all the doors and windows closed so Polly doesn't fly away. Yes, Grandpa Pig. <laughs> Goodbye, Peppa. Goodbye, George. <laughs> Goodbye, Granny Pig. Goodbye, Grandpa Pig. <laughs> Would you like a cup of tea? Uh, would you like a cup of tea? <laughs> George has got Polly's bird seed. <laughs> George, that is too much bird seed. Polly will go very big and burst like a balloon. Pop! Uh, burst like a balloon! Pop! <laughs> 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 What's that noise? Ice cream! <laughs> <laughs> Ice cream! Hooray! <laughs> oh dear, George has forgotten to close the door. <laughs> Ice cream! Ice cream! It is Miss Rabbit, the ice cream lady. Hello, Mummy Pig. <laughs> Hello, Miss Rabbit. Four ice creams, please. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> George, you forgot to close the door. <laughs> Polly will have flown away. Don't worry, Peppa. I'm sure Polly is still inside. Polly's not here. Oh. <laughs> We've lost Polly. Grandpa and Granny are going to be very sad. <laughs> Maybe we should try the garden. Look, what's that? What has Mummy Pig seen in the garden? Ah! It's Polly! Hooray! Ah! But, Daddy, how are we going to get Polly down from the tree? Ah! Don't worry, Peppa. I'll rescue Polly. Come on, Polly. Ah! Would you like a cup of tea? Ah! Oh, no. Polly has flown higher up the tree. Oh, dear. Don't worry, Peppa. I'll be very careful. Come on, Polly. Ah, bird seed! I wonder where George is going. George has got Polly's bird seed. Polly loves to eat bird seed. Ah! Ah! <laughs> George has got Polly down from the tree. Hooray! Hooray! What's that noise? Daddy Pig's mobile phone is ringing. What? Oh. Hello? Oh, Granny Pig. Hello, Daddy Pig. Please, may I talk to Polly? Yes, of course. Hello, Polly. Are you having a nice holiday? Ah! Hello, Polly. Are you having a nice holiday? <laughs> oh! oh. <laughs> <laughs> Foggy day. <laughs> Peppa and George are going to the playground today. Should we drive to the playground? No, let's walk. Look, it's just over there. The playground is quite close. <laughs> OK, let's walk. This way, everyone. <laughs> We're going to the playground. We're going to the playground. <laughs> oh! Where has the sky gone? Don't worry, Peppa. It's just fog. What's fog? Fog is a cloud that is on the ground instead of in the sky. Very thick fog. I can't see a thing. Hmm. Maybe we should go back home. Yes, we'll go to the playground another day. Oh. It is too foggy to find the playground, so Peppa and George have to go back home. Now, which way is home? Are we lost, Daddy Pig? <laughs> Don't worry, I know exactly where we are. This way. Oof. 
Who put that tree there? Daddy Pig has walked into a tree. Are you OK, Daddy Pig? Yes, I'm fine. <laughs> this way. Daddy Pig, do you know where you're going? Yes, of course I do. I don't think we'll ever find our house again. <laughs> I'm sure we will, Peppa. We're only in our garden. <laughs> oh, it's the ducks. <laughs> Hello, Mrs Duck. Have you lost your pond? <laughs> We're lost too. We are not lost. I know exactly where we are. <laughs> See you later, ducks. Good luck finding your pond. Whoa. Oh! Daddy Pig has found the duck pond. That's lucky. Yes. What a stroke of luck. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy, Mrs Duck says thank you. You're most welcome, Mrs Duck. <laughs> <laughs> now, let's find our house. I'm sure it's this way. Hello? Did you hear something? Yes. I thought I heard someone say... Hello! It's Mummy Rabbit with Rebecca and Richard. Hello, Peppa. We're lost. <laughs> Hello, Rebecca. We're lost too. We wanted to go to the playground. So did we. But it's too foggy to get there. Come on, everyone. Back to our house until the fog clears. Daddy Pig, do you know where you're going? Yes, of course I do. This way. Yes, yes Daddy, Daddy Pig. Pig. Aha! I've found our little hill. We'll soon be home. Hooray! Our house should be just about here. Oh. Daddy Pig has found a ladder. That's strange. We don't have a ladder in our garden. Goodness me! Can you see where we are, Daddy Pig? Yes, I can. <laughs> Daddy, where are we? Why don't you have a look? OK. Wow! Wow! I can see everything again. The fog is going away. <laughs> We're at the playground. Hooray! Whee! We're at the playground. We're at the playground. Whee! <laughs> Well, that's lucky. But I thought we were trying to get home. So did I. Maybe we did get a bit lost, after all. <laughs> <laughs> Police boat trip. <laughs> Grandpa Pig is taking Pepper and George on a boat trip. Uh? Polly Parrot is going too. Uh? Grandpa Pig! <laughs> Have you got your mobile phone? Yes, Granny Pig. Don't drop it in the water. No, Granny Pig. Is it switched on? Yes, Granny Pig. Bye. Bye bye. Here is Grandad Dog. Ahoy there! Ahoy there! Lovely day to go sailing. I would go too, but my boat needs a clean. Ho, ho, ho. I don't know why you bother cleaning that rusty boat. I'm surprised it's still afloat. This rusty boat will still be afloat long after your old tin boat has sunk to the bottom of the river. <laughs> Grandad Dog is Grandpa Pig's very best friend. Full steam ahead. Goodbye. I am the captain of this boat, and when the captain tells you to do something, you must do it. Aye, aye, aye captain. Aye, aye, captain. <laughs> Polly Parrot copies everything that is said. George, raise the flag. George, raise the flag. <laughs> Pepper, ring the bell. Pepper, ring the bell. <laughs> Grandpa. Can I be the captain, please? OK. But as captain, you must wear this hat. <laughs> now Peppa is the captain, and everyone must do what she says. Ring the bell. Turn that wheel. Aye, aye, Captain Peppa. Jump up and down. <laughs> 
<laughs> captain Pepper is a bit bossy. Perhaps I should be the captain again. We don't want to crash into anything. Steering the boat can be tricky. Luckily, I'm good at steering. <laughs> oh dear. Grandpa Pig's boat has crashed into a little island. Grandpa! We're stuck! I'll ring Granny Pig. She can get help. <coughs> Whoa! Oh! Grandpa Pig has dropped his phone in the water. Granny Pig speaking. Hello? 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 Somehow, we need to get a message to Granny. Ah? Uh, message to Granny? <sniffs> Polly can fly to Granny. Good idea, Pepper. And I can teach Polly what to say. Grandpa Pig says... Grandpa Pig says... Help! 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 There you see. Easy peasy. Grandpa Pig says easy peasy. You silly old bird. You silly old bird. Hello, Polly. What are you doing here? Uh, Grandpa Pig says... What does Grandpa Pig say? You silly old bird. Oh! Help! Help! Goodness me! Grandpa must need help. <laughs> Granddad Dog! Hello, Granny Pig! Grandpa Pig needs help. Please, could you rescue him? Madam, I would be delighted. Hooray! Ahoy there! Do you need rescuing, Captain? Um, maybe. Would you like my rusty old boat? To rescue you? Yes, please, Grandad Dog. Catch this, Captain. Aye, aye, Skipper. Grandad Dog is Grandpa Pig's very best friend. Granny, did Polly tell you we needed help? Yes, Polly is a very clever parrot. Say, I'm a clever parrot. Woof, woof. I'm a clever parrot. Woof, woof. <laughs> Grandpa at the playground. Grandpa Pig is looking after Pepper and George today. Now, Grandpa, I will tell you how everything works. This is the slide. You climb up here and you slide down there. Whee! And everyone takes it in turns. Ho, ho, ho. I know what a slide is, Pepper. I used to play on one myself when I was a little piggy. Did you have swings too in the olden days? Ho, ho. We had swings and climbing frames and roundabouts. Ooh. But my favourite was the slide. It is my favourite too. <laughs> Whee! Everyone takes it in turns to have a go on the slide. Whee! <laughs> Naughty Richard, you know you have to wait your turn. Richard Rabbit finds it hard to wait his turn. Oh, dear. It's not easy being small, is it, Richard? <laughs> because Richard is little, I don't think he should have to wait. I wouldn't change the rules if I were you, Grandpa Pig. Nonsense. The children understand, don't you? <laughs> Whee! But, Grandpa, George is little and he has to wait his turn. <laughs> Yes, George is little, so he shouldn't have to wait either. <laughs> Whee! Oh dear, Whee! Richard and George are taking all the turns on the slide. Grandpa, when do we get to go on the slide? Don't worry, Pepper. They won't be on it for long. <sighs> I'm bored of waiting. Me too. Let's play on the swing. <laughs> Here is Pedro Pony on the swing. Nay. Pedro, 
slow. Can I have a go now? I just want to swing a bit more. But you've been on the swing for ages. Grandpa Pig, can you push me a little bit, please? I think it is someone else's turn now, Pedro. But I have to go home soon. Oh, oh I see. That's different. Let me push you, then. But, Grandpa! <laughs> <laughs> I'm bored of waiting. Me too. And me. Well, let's fly on the roundabout. <laughs> Everyone wants to get on the roundabout. <laughs> too many children on the roundabout. Everybody off. <gasps> but, Grandpa Pig, I was actually here first. Ah, then you can get back on the roundabout. I need to get on too. Oh, why is that, Rebecca? Um, because it's my birthday soon. Oh, uh, OK. <laughs> and me! Uh, all right. <laughs> is everybody ready? Yes! yes. <laughs> Stop! There are no boys on the roundabout. Um, <laughs> now is everybody ready? wearing glasses. Can I go on, please? The children are making up their own rules. I need to get them because I like carrots. <laughs> now, are you all ready to go? No, I have to get on because I can do this. <laughs> Here is Mummy Pig. How are you getting on, Grandpa Pig? I I'm confused. These playground rules are too complicated. There is only one rule, Grandpa Pig, and that is... Everyone waits their turn. Whee! <laughs> what? Even the little ones? Even the little ones. What about the very old ones? Like Grandpa. Even the very old ones like Grandpa. At the playground, everyone has their turn. <laughs> Whistling. It is a lovely sunny morning and Daddy Pig is reading his newspaper. Daddy, what are you doing? I'm reading the newspaper. You're making a funny sound. I'm whistling. Oh. Whistling is fun. You should try it. I don't know how to. It's easy. Just put your lips together and blow. <sighs> try making a smaller O shape. <laughs> oh, oh, like this. And then you can whistle a tune. I've got the wrong kind of mouth. Your mouth is fine. You just need to practice. It's impossible. It takes time to learn how to do important things, like riding a bicycle or playing the piano. <laughs> it took me years to learn how to wiggle my ears. Wow! <laughs> Mummy Pig is in the kitchen making cookies. What are you doing, Peppa? I'm learning to whistle. Oh, I see. <sighs> Mummy, can you whistle? I don't know. I've never tried. It takes a lot of practice. <gasps> oh, yes! Mummy Pig can whistle. You can whistle because you are old, Mummy. Thank you, Peppa. <sighs> George is in the bedroom, playing with his toy rocket. George, I'm learning to whistle. You make an O shape with your mouth and blow. Don't worry, George. It's almost impossible, like wiggling your ears. George can wiggle his ears. <laughs> Whistling is harder. George can whistle. Oh. <laughs> What's wrong, Peppa? I can't whistle, but everybody else can. Never mind. I'm making cookies. Would you like to lick the spoon? No, thank you, Mummy. 
Can I ring Susie Sheep instead? OK, Peppa. <coughs> Hello, Mrs Pig. Hello, Mrs Sheep. Can Peppa talk to Susie, please? Hello, Susie. <laughs> Hello, Peppa. What are you doing? I'm learning to whistle, but I can't do it yet. Hmm, that sounds hard. It's impossible. Uh, can you whistle, Susie? No. <coughs> oh, good. I mean, that's sad if you can't whistle. But good, because I can't whistle. What's whistling anyway? You put your lips together and blow. Like this. <whistles> Hello, Peppa? The cookies are ready. Oh, goody. Cookies. <coughs> They'll be hot. You should blow on them first. Ooh, ha. <laughs> <laughs> Do you not want a cookie, Peppa? No, thank you, Mummy. I think I might go outside and be on my own for a little bit. Can you whistle yet? It's no use, Daddy. I'm never going to whistle, ever. Have you been practising? <laughs> yes, lots, but it doesn't work. You need a little rest, Pepper. Here, have a cookie. It's hot. You should blow. <whistles> oh, what's that? It sounded like a whistle to me. <laughs> what a lovely tune. Peppa has learned how to whistle. <laughs> I can whistle. <laughs> <laughs>